Welcome ladies and gentlemen to a new video. In this video we will be counting down the top 10 WWE superstars and divas who are going to make their debut, WWE Games debut in WWE 2K17. Of course this, there will be honorable mentions before the number one pick, but let's start off with number 10. And at number 10 we have the American Alpha. Of course, the American Alpha, uh, pretty big right now, blowing up and everything, getting their Dota uh, Tag Team Championship match uh, at NXT TakeOver Dallas. Uh, well, they'll be taking on um, one of our other uh, picks for this, who will make their debut in Dota 2K17. Of course, with the American Alpha, we get their theme song entrance, and they're, of course, most of their moves, but they'll probably be like just the Brock Lesnar's a million uh, suplexes and everything like that. But either way, that's pretty exciting, and hopefully the American Alpha will be fun to play as. Either way, let's start off with our number nine pick, which is The Revival. So, <clears throat> The Revival will, of course, uh, make their debut. Of course, have to make their debut because they're the tag team champions. They've been the champs for quite some time. So, it only be fair that they um, get their uh, chance to be in the game this year, along with the American Alpha. And, um, I don't know. It's just... It's kind of weird. I'm not too excited. That's where they're at number nine. But, um... Yeah, yeah, the revival um should be fun to play as as well. Get their theme song, get their entrance, and everything like that. And now let's go with our <clears throat> number eight pick. And at number eight we have Braun Strowman. So. Braun Strowman um, made his debut way back when, I think it was in August or something like that, of course debuting alongside the Wyatt family. Um, the Wyatt family, pretty cool, I mean, it's like, we, we, they gotta have him, of course, um, have his uh, moves, such as the standing choke thing that he does, and uh, they already have his other finisher, which is like the um, face buster, so... Should be fun to play as as well. Another big character to play as. Um, yeah, that's that's gonna be really fun. And uh, yeah, now let's get to. Let's get to our number uh, seven pick. And at number seven, we have the ECW original. So, um, the ECW originals includes um, the Dudley Boys, Tommy Dreamer, and Rhino. Um, of course, pretty much everybody on this list, uh, on uh, this team, will be making their return to the WWE games. Um, it's been a while since they, you know, did anything. And, uh, especially Tommy Dreamer. Right now, I haven't seen it in a while here. So, I mean, yeah, but hopefully they'll add the uh, all their stuff. New theme song. Um, hopefully a new animation for the gore. Hopefully. <laughs> and maybe give the same animation to uh, Roman for the, his spear. But either way, ECW original should be fun to play as as well. And let's get on with our number six pick. And at number six, we have Austin Aries. So, um, Austin Aries making his debut at NXT TakeOver Dallas, taking on Baron Corbin, of all people. <laughs> yeah, it's not, it's not going to be fun at all. It's not. <laughs> 
Oh man. But anyway, real life. Austin, but in the video game, should be fun to play as Austin Aries. Um, <clears throat> should have some new animations for the Brain Buster. Um, I'm, I'm guessing a new animation for the Brain Buster. Um, of course, the last chance re. So everything that Austin Aries has done, hopefully. They'll give all his stuff in the game, all his uh, old moves from TNA and whatnot, so. And his uh, ROH stuff and everything like that. But either way, let's get on with the next pick. And at number five, we have Asuka. So Asuka, um, gonna be taking on Bailey. Of course, this will be her debut in the Dai Dai Games franchise as well. Um, Asuka taking on uh, Bailey, and um, it's just like I'm really confused on Asuka. I don't really know what her finisher is. Just sort of like, eh. but let me just do a quick research here. So yeah, um, she'll have the spin kick and the Oscar lock. Hopefully, a new animation for, for well, uh, a new animation that will be for the Oscar lock. Um, should be a cool thing, and her uh, her taunts will be amazing, <laughs> like actually amazing. Anyway, Oscar. Should be fun to play as once she comes out. And either way, let's get to my next pick. And at number four, we have Alberto Del Rio. So, um, Alberto making his return from the 2K15, I believe. He was left out of 2K16 because he was fired for assaulting somebody backstage because they were racist and um, yeah so um hopefully they'll add his new finisher um the double stop hopefully from different areas like there's the one he does from uh the top turnbuckle to the ropes for, to the opponent hanging on the ropes and there's the one of course where he's on uh on the um, in the tree of well, his mind is in the tree of well. So hopefully they'll have all those new stuff for him. But uh, yeah, and of course, not that much. I mean, he doesn't have the limo. He doesn't have the ring announcer or anything like that. Um, hopefully, if they change up the gameplay and everything and make it more strategic and tactical and everything like that, hopefully there'll be more stuff for him. But either way, let's get to my number third. And at number three, we have the four horsewomen. So, four horsewomen, including Bailey, um, <clears throat> Charlotte, Sasha Banks, and Becky Lynch. So, of course, with all of that, we'll have, of course, the um, figure eight that Charlotte does. Hopefully, a new animation for the spear as well. Um, natural selection is already in the game, and hopefully we'll have a new uh, Bailey to Belly, a new Bailey to Belly for Bailey, and um, uh, yeah, this armor, a disarmor and new animation uh, for the disarmor, and um, hopefully the bag statement, a new uh, animation for that as well. Um, all these girls should be fun to play as. Um, I'm really excited. Hopefully they're in the game. They got the shaft last year. <laughs> They got scanned and everything. Tokyo was like, no, nobody want to play as these guys. Anyway, get on with our number second, our second pick. And at number two, we have Shinsuke Nakamura. So, um... Shinsuke Nakamura making his debut at NXT TakeOver Dallas, taking on Sami Zayn. And um, hopefully, <clears throat> with Sami Zayn, 
hopefully with that match, we'll get to see all his new finishers and stuff. Um, because I'm assuming they're not gonna give him the Umaya again. <laughs> like, that's just not possible. Because they, they, you know, safety and everything. So, maybe not gonna use the Umaya, maybe we're gonna use a new finisher. Maybe the GTS, I have no idea. Uh, if he does have the Umaya, hopefully there's a couple new animations for that in-game as well. Um... And there's already the one in the corner, so hopefully there's just one that's like running or one where they're on the ground or something like that. I'm not really sure. Maybe they're even like a diving one or a standing one because he does one that's standing as well. But either way, <clears throat> let's get on with our honorable mentions. And at number one. We have AJ Styles. So AJ, not gonna be adding much in terms of moves because pretty much have all of AJ's moves in the game. Hopefully there's some new animations. I'm not entirely sure how they would do that, but eh. so um of course his new entrance, his new theme song. Of course, his attires, everything like that. Maybe, um, well, of course, a couple new taunts as well. Maybe, maybe they'll add a new animation for the Styles Clash. And um, a comeback or something like that. Maybe, I don't know, maybe it's somehow get into the pay like I'm not sure. But either way, that's AJ Styles. And that's it for this video. Um, pretty excited for all of these guys making their returns and debuts in WWE 2K17. Um, I really, really am excited for 2K17. Um, hopefully add some new gameplay stuff, so like new, um, like just stuff in it, like new mechanics and stuff, like adding another thing other than stamina, or have like stamina be more effective, something like that, I'm not sure. But anyway, that's it for this video, hopefully you guys enjoyed it, if you did, please like, comment, and subscribe, see ya in the next video. Thank you.